Alright guys, Street Racer didn't realize he hit a cop. Let's check it out, let's check it out. In March, a corporal was positioned in the median of a road as he clocked two street racers going 111 miles an hour. One Dude, oh my gosh, that's so dangerous, man. Why, why? I heard that right. He said 111 miles per hour, man. That's way too much. That's way too much, guys. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. One of them, in a blue Nissan, then lost control and swerved into the median, slamming into the corporal's car. The Nissan continued to drive away while the corporal's airbags were deployed. He was what? Not, not seriously injured. The blue Nissan's bumper happened to fall off, leaving the license plate behind. Damn, and bro, they hit it. The address for they hit. They straight up smacked that car, man. This is why I don't do something silly like racing. Don't they have like um some sort of like tr race tracks you can pay for and go to and race like without worrying about stuff like this happening, guys? This guy made a huge mistake and bailed. For the license plate, and this is where body cam footage starts. As always, I have the full police report in the description, and at the end of this video, there's footage from a witness who explains the crash. Yes, same watermark as the last video, guys. Even the same symbol on his, um, like, the same exact stuff. What? I just want to let you know that orange charger, that was the Oh my gosh, I should put, like, a, a flashing lights warning on this video, bro. Those lights are bright. Stop me, ran me off the road. Okay, oh, when you hit gosh. one of our police vehicles. You can even see the reflection bouncing off the palm of my hand, guys. ...and never stopped and caused an airbag deployment on the police vehicle, oh, so... Oh, God. He ran me off the road. All right. We need his car for me? Yes, sir. Hey, down for weapons real quick. Yeah. He's like, yo, this is protocol. I gotta just pat you down. You know, you're going to jail. I'm gonna take you to jail. Please don't resist that much, you know, stuff like that, you know, just gotta be chill, level-headed, not, not get the suspect to overreact or anything. And everything should be good, right guys? Everything should be good. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm not worried about the money right now. No, but I, I don't really need it to get him out of jail. Okay. He's not under arrest right the okay. second, but we're trying to figure out what the hell's going on. And she's like, I'm already going to get him out of jail. What a nice mom. Good girls, you gotta wait. Walk that way. Yes, sir. What's going on? <laughs> we were just riding, there was another car. Okay. I'm fast approaching, like. Yeah, so get okay. Oh, I thought that was a mom. I'm not sure if that's a mom or the girlfriend, guys. I can't tell. The boy stayed speeding a little bit, but he just, I, I don't know if he hit a gravel or what. The car obviously is a fast car. I'm sorry, I'm afraid. Okay. So who, who is he to you? He's my husband, fiance, whatever. Okay, so it was just you and your fiance in the car? Yes, sir. Okay. So was he raising someone? Oh, yeah, that is the, uh, you know, girlfriend, fiance. All right, all right. What was he doing? No, they weren't racing. They, they you know, they were revving the engine up, you know, they were both going a little fast, but I who, think he had a touch who, of gravel. Who's both of us? I don't know who the other person was that was driving down the road. You know, they were just driving down the road. We don't know them from anybody, um, and they kept going, um, so I don't know. Okay. I don't know if he hit something or if it lost traction or what don't go in that car okay, everything in that car is mine okay my, my word you almost is... fucking killed a deputy down the street Maybe. you don't touch not a goddamn thing in this car do you understand me yes. back away dang bro he, he's pissed he's pissed bro dang okay this cop's a little bit a little bit unhinged a little bit unhinged yes, sir. fucking guy almost killed west can I please talk to somebody? No. I, I know I know I'm in a lot of trouble. And I just Hold want to say. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Don't say, Don't say, a, word. say a word. You understand me? Yes, sir. Not a word. Yes, sir. Alright, what's your name? Brandon Ingram. Alright, I'm Deputy Carter for Lake County Sheriff's Office. You have the room right, right in the main side. Anything you want you'll talk to me tonight? Say again? Are those rights of mine do you want to talk to me tonight? No, sir. No? Okay, no, cool. yeah, no, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. I'm sorry, I wasn't understanding the question. Would I like to talk to you tonight? Yes, I would like I would... Alright, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say, uh, talk to me tonight. Yes, I would like to talk to you. Okay. 
Just so you know, you have waived your rights to speak with uh, with an attorney. Okay, okay. Informed of the Miranda rights, I'm not sure if they cut and read the full Miranda rights, but... Present, okay? Okay, yes, sir. All right, so you want to tell me what happened tonight? Um, yes, we was going down uh, US-1, um, and a orange charger started cutting me off and trying to race me. Okay. And when I got beside him, I tried to go around him, and he physically cut me off, and, like, he... I guess he thought he was in front of me, mm -hmm. and he came right in front of me and, went, like, literally pushed me right off the road. Gotcha. How fast were you going? Uh, 65, 70. Okay. How fast were you going? How fast were you going? 65, 70, 70. <clears throat> All right. Lot to me. Again, how fast were you going? I was hey, bro, he, he's not having it, guys. He's like, yo, you're lying to me. And we keep seeing this often in videos, guys. Where the officer's like, you're lying to me, you know? I mean, uh, like, uh, how are they able to tell, though? That That's that's what I'm asking here. How are they able to tell? I was not going that I was you 75 skid, at the most. You have skid marks for about a quarter mile, son. I promise you, 60 I miles put an it hour, on my you case. Stop. I was going 75 Don't at the that. most. At the most, I was not speeding at all because she was telling me, please don't. Not so tonight. my deputy that got you at 112 miles an hour was lying. I was not, no, I promise you, I was not going 112 miles an hour, sir. No, sir. No, okay. sir. I was you know not. we got a deputy that's going to the hospital right now because you hurt him that bad when you hit him. No. Okay, now I understand why he's pissed. He actually hurt a, a police officer doing this. Wow, sad, sad. I'm um, actually, um, oh my gosh, bro. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. You don't understand that, right? Somebody. Please don't. Don't. And you please. kept going. No, I seriously didn't see the cop because I was going to try to go after him. I swear I followed him. He went towards Rimfire Element. Why, why is he even trying to follow the guy that he's appeared? Like, his story is just so... Making no sense here, guys. Why, why would he follow some guy that's try, trying to race? He's trying to race or whatever, guys. It makes no sense. So he didn't cut you off. Now you're going after him. I went after him to get his... Ta I, was he going to just let me go off? There's the just, laws. Just let me... Just No, I was, no, okay. no sir. I'm not lying. No, sir. Okay. Are you got anything else to say? No, sir. He, All right, you've been placed under arrest tonight, okay? Yes, sir. We'll transfer him over to my car. You know, it means nothing, but from the bottom of my heart, I really was not trying to do anything stupid. My girl had me in line. Bro, he's just caught. That's it, That's it, man. He did something si silly, man. He did something silly. Not the cool thing to do. So why didn't you stop? Because I was trying to go after him. So would y'all go after go after him? How are you gonna go after he somebody? But yet you're pulled into your driveway. He was sitting there cutting me off. He was sitting. He got away from me. I have flat tires. I, I can tell he's lying as well, man. Like I did a little bit of like lying research to tell someone's lying. And, he, it's just straight up he's lying here guys you know what i mean that's what it seems like that's what i he, he's just trying to say whatever to get out of the situation made up a little lie in his head he got away from me how'd you get the front I, tires i prompt from skidding out he was sitting there cussing me out the whole time that's my girlfriend where's your rear bumper at I guess it's where I spun out. We got it for this time. Yeah, uh, yeah, no, I know. Yeah. That's no, what I'm yeah. saying. No. No, I wasn't trying to bust. So like, I, I, y'all know where I live. Y'all pass here every day. Is, can you please tell me how the other officer is doing? Is he okay? He almost killed him. Yeah, he's hurting. Whoa. Uh, hey, there we go. You, you're good now. Okay, so. Uh, because of certain rules, you swear or affirm that what you're about to tell me is true and accurate to the best of your knowledge? Yes. All right, so what happened? Oh, no, I was just driving to Paul Cooch. Actually, hang on. i got to get you to say your name and date of birth for me. I forgot oh, that part. Okay, so now you just tell me what happened, please, and we'll get you out of here. Uh, I was headed to Paul Cooch. So you were, which way were you going? I was headed to Paul Cooch. You are headed to, so you were on that, those lanes over there? Yes, sir. Okay, so you were northbound. Right. Okay. Um... Two cars came by and soon they was racing. And uh, as they came by, they was racing against one of the cars. Like uh, they were the, actually the blue car tried to go in front of the other car as they was racing. And 
he got like pretty much like fishtail. And when he got fishtail, he kind of like spent him, shot him across the lane, and he ran into the cop car. You know shot him across like the meat shot. He shot across the median. Dang, bro. Never street race, guys. Because you might do something super stu silly like get an officer sent to the hospital or even hurt someone, guys. It's so, uh, uh, so shame. I, I feel. I feel ashamed even watching this. Right across the median. Oh, oh, so these are probably his tracks then, huh? Right. Is that where he came Whatever through? Whatever you see the tracks across, they was racing. He like T-balled them and like pushed them towards this like. This so this cop car was what? Probably over here in the turnaround spot or something? Or I tell you what, when I seen it, I was about down there. I was like, I was pretty much down there. So when I seen it, I, I think he pretty much, when he T-balled them, he ran up to like, to the other lane and he ran into your officer. So, okay. so the other officer, other officer was probably coming this way? Yeah, the think? other officer was coming this way. He was, okay. he was like he going towards Bunnell. Gotcha. Southbound coming okay. towards Bunnell. And he ran into him. So, you know, me just being a good Samaritan, I can not just see there, see him, like sit there and see him like in the car that had been wrecked. So I stopped to see if he was okay. He told me, Dang, bro. He was okay. I said, are you good? He told me it's good, I leave. So I, I went to go to my friend's house. I came back and he seen me, he was like... Wait, I thought the officer went to the hospital though, guys. I don't understand completely. He was the guy, I was like, yeah. I mean, I was just checking up on him or whatever, but like I said, it was two cars racing. Got T-bone, ran into the officer. By, by racing, they were going... They were side by side, or going fast, or what was what, what racing? Man, they came around. They, they were going, uh, just driving uh, super, super uh, dangerously. That is uh, totally against the law. Now this guy's gonna, you know... Had some hefty charges against him for sure. You know, he, he might spend jail, even though he's getting bonded out, he might st still uh, uh, spend some jail time, guys. It's shot by me. They, uh, they were moving fast, what you're saying? Yeah, I, I, <laughs> dog, everything, all so the they, they probably had to get one behind the other to go around you, right? Right. Okay. Came in, that's how they came. They came around one by one. When, they, when both of them came around, they split up. They took both lanes. One took the right lane, one took the left lane. And it went like that. Kind of get some blue cars probably in the left lane? The blue cars in the left lane. Okay. The orange cars in the right lane. And he just lost control somehow and... You know, as they racing, as they racing, I guess the blue car felt like he had the ups on the orange car. So he tried to switch lanes and get in front of him. Obviously, it, it didn't work. Man, sucks we don't have CCC to TV footage of his silly mistake here. I'm not sure if I'd even want to see it or if it would be allowed on YouTube, guys. When you got over, you ran into the orange because the orange car hit him going that fast pace and shifted him like T boned him and pushed him over here to your officer. That's exactly what happened. Awesome. So, yeah. Yeah. I really appreciate it. I know you're trying to get yeah. somewhere. I know you're cold. Yeah. If FHP has any further questions, they may call you back. But I think I think we've got a pretty good enough statement for you for what happened. All right. Hey, I appreciate you. Hey, I appreciate you, Th man. Thanks for checking on my balls. Hey, man. Ain't no problem, man. Anytime. Glad he's okay. Tell him I said I'm glad he's okay, man. I will. All you right. have a good evening. You do the same, man. I thought he went to the hospital, though, guys. He literally said he went to the hospital, but now he's okay. I don't understand, guys. Again, for checking on No problem. Brandon was charged with felony leaving the scene of an accident involving injury and two misdemeanors, one for reckless driving involving property damage and one for racing on the highway. This happened about a month ago, so it's still going through the court system. A silly mistake, man. If he, if he stayed there, he probably wouldn't have gotten the felony, man, but now he's got a felony charge against him. When their third party runs you off the road or not, you can't leave the scene of an accident. Yo, Tay Zani also commenting on this video. Man, Tay Zani comments on so many videos like this. Props the guy who stopped and then came back to check on the situation. Good man. Yeah, for sure, for sure. That witness was awesome. Him stopping to check an on an officer and then coming back speaks a lot about him and his character. It does, it does. We need more humans like him on Earth. We do, we do. Alright guys, like, comment, subscribe. I do all my reactions live on Twitch. If you want to come through, say hi. We'll do, read a few more comments. 
and the officer was not having it. He wasn't. That's exactly what they said as well. Probably the man who stopped to check and give his statement. Yeah, that was Prowse as well. Now they got a witness and stuff. But that's that's our video, guys. We'll see you guys next one, okay? Peace out, everyone. Um, yep, check out Active Police Cam in the description. Later.